Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna do this without silverware because I'm a bachelor and I do my own dishes sometimes. <laughs> sometimes my roommate does the dishes. So I don't wanna use silverware because then I have to wash more dishes. So supplies, you'll need one plate, uh, plastic cheap from Target. Squeeze mayonnaise from Safeway. Enriched white bread, $1 per loaf, also from Safeway. Sara Lee honey ham or brown sugar ham uh, from Safeway. Lucerne naturally smoked sliced Gouda from Safeway. <laughs> okay, set out plate. Okay. Uh, two slices of bread, vertically, not horizontally, and not side by side. They have to be opposite from each other. That's going to be important later. <laughs> okay, take mayonnaise, open. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to spread a little bit on each uh, half. Um, a little bit less on the top half than on the bottom half. Uh, the reason for this is the bottom half here is going to be the bottom half of the sandwich when I eat it. And you want the bottom half to have the most delicious stuff because of, um, basically it's closer to your tongue and so you get the most delicious stuff closest to your tongue. On average, you just get to eat more delicious stuff and taste more delicious stuff. Okay. Next, we're gonna take the cheese. I'm gonna open the zipper pouch pack. I'm going to use the paper provided in order to prevent the Gouda from um, from being oops from being cut up too much as I pull it apart from the other cheese, but it is going to get pulled, cut up a little bit. I so this is what I use to spread the mayonnaise because I don't I'm not using silverware, so I'm going to spread the top half first um, using the cheese, right? No silverware. Okay, now I have a bit of mayonnaise on the cheese. That's great because now we get even more mayonnaise on the bottom half. And mayonnaise is delicious because it's basically pure fat. So now we have the bottom half has more mayonnaise than the top. And the cheese still has mayonnaise on it. Uh, the cheese now goes with the mayonnaise face down onto the bottom half. Take your ham. Uh, this is actually an un unopened package. So I'm going to open it. I have to actually open some open some plastic here. Okay, we're gonna take two slices. This part's a little tricky, so pay attention. Okay, the first slice, okay, we have two slices. The first slice, uh, we're gonna lay it down and across and then fold it back over half. And if we don't do this, it's just gonna go off the edge of the sandwich and it's gonna be a really, un a really messy sandwich, which is no good. The second slice, you're gonna basically pick off where the first slice left off and then fold it over so that one third of it is where the, the crease is and the remaining bit uh, folds over. So now we have a symmetric, rotationally symmetric bit of ham. And uh, and the sandwich has even ham all the way through. There's, there's three slices slick, three slices thick no matter where you look, which is what you want. You want it to be even an even eating experience. It's great, uh, perfect, that's, that's desirable. Uh, and then the reason that we um, put them not side by side, but rather facing each other was so that I can just very simply close it like that and the sandwich is done. We now have a uh, ham and gouda cheese sandwich. Perfect, the perfect ratios of each of the materials. And we didn't even use any silverware, so. And of course the final step is enjoy.